Are there any spirits here with us? Let me just see if that actually went through. Oh, that was red. That's good. That's really good. You're here. You're exactly on it. Orange yep. and red. You're here. And I am freezing. You're cold? O I am. Overly cold? I don't know if it's the breeze. Oh, no, they could be. Because that was a really strong breeze. They could be on you. I am freezing, bro. Okay. I'm like shaking. Can you light that meter up again? You can go close to it and it'll turn red. Thank you for doing that. Yeah, you're, you're definitely here with me. That either. Try this again. But that's going off for a reason. Anybody here? Yep, this... You're here, correct? I hear you. Okay, here I come. Stay there. I'm approaching you. You're doing good. I'm approaching you. What'd you leave for? We'll play a game. Now come back, and I'll move away. You do that again. Oh, were you just next to me? This thing just went off. It's going off again. Are you right there? You can come closer. I feel you. Yeah, but you can increase the sensitivity number. Yeah. Wow, when I went into that room, I felt it. There's something here that you can communicate with us. If you can get close to that, I'll move away. It's all you. Take and if you want to touch that, that'll change color. I'll know you're here because I felt you. There's no doubt that you weren't here. It's not a person. Listen for a minute. Yeah, apparently this place is bad on energy. What the hell is that? I don't know. So we had a little bit of a paranormal encounter. Yeah. John felt someone... Go ahead. Yeah, so apparently... Um, this place is extremely haunted. In, the, in leaving the kitchen, I felt a change in temperature. The hair... In the back of my neck stood up and I got goosebumps um, and cold chills and then it subsided so the entity apparently moved away but did come up behind me um, we did take a temperature reading yeah. and his arm was in fact colder than the rest of his body that's the only way I can document it unfortunately Unless yeah I wasn't recording at the moment so I'm sorry but that's what we have so far We 
we didn't know what type of dog, but it sounded like a beagle, which meant if we were caught, we could possibly be attacked. So we decided to hide out in one of the buildings until the ghost was clear. Unfortunately, the ghost wasn't exactly clear. So we decided to introduce ourselves. I don't think the dog has a chain. Yeah. It wasn't on leash. The front one was caught by lightning. By light. And it caught on fire. So this one was deliberately set? I, I don't honestly know. I don't know a lot about it. Paranormal experience. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Sounds like he's doing it. We're us. being shaken up from this experience. Huh. We figured it would be best to move on to the next building and continue our exploration. We are alone. Um, we hear four wheelers. If, if, they, if the camera in that building caught us, they would have got off their trikes, four wheelers, and came into the building. So that's not why they came here. You know what I'm saying? You could, I want to go over there. Because they're all marked. I want to go over there so badly. I want to go in that building. Uh, I think we should. Yeah, go ahead. And we should go upstairs and look out the window real quick. Have a sense, see if we can yeah. see him. Found the jackpot.
Oh, someone put their explorer's name on here. Still a little flooded, so. This is where they hung up all the tools. Yeah, this is where he was. He was messing around with the fence. Look at all the bowling products still left. Yeah. Still packaged. Did you get anything? 